Hey Health Nuts, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole Gonsalves and today I'm sharing an updated fall morning routine. It's not officially fall yet, but I already feel like I am in full fall mode with the cooler weather and all the delicious fall foods I've been craving. So I thought I would just like be ahead of the game and go ahead and film a fall morning routine and everything I've been doing lately to start my day. Now, before we hop in, I just want to remind you guys, the Health Nut Cookbook is officially out into the world. It just launched last week. It was crazy. We had what I'm calling our book wedding with huge celebration with our friends, family, and just colleagues in the YouTube space. And I, it was just the best day ever. And if you guys want to check out the book, I'll have links down below. Also, we are, I'm doing my very first book signing this Sunday, September 15th at the New Market Chapters from 2 to 3 p.m. So if you guys are in the area, it would mean so much if you guys made it out and supported me and got your book signed. I will give you free hugs and we may even have an extra goodie on site when you guys uh, come and sign your book. So stay tuned for that. But I'm just so excited to meet you guys and sign your books and just show my gratitude because you guys rock and thank you so much for all the support you've already given this beautiful book. Also, if you guys don't live in Ontario, we're going to be doing a dinner with Nicole, aka me. Sounds very weird talking to myself in third person, but uh, we're going to be doing a little live virtual dinner party on September 19th. So that's next Thursday, not this Thursday, next Thursday. If you guys want to tune in and get all the details for that, you can sign up. It's free to join. A link will be down below in the info box and you guys can cook with me live. I'm going to be cooking my uh, white smoky white bean kale soup from the cookbook. So if you guys want to join, links down below. Let's hop right into the video and I'll share with you guys my morning routine. Good morning, everyone. I'm actually sitting on my bed while recording this voiceover, which I feel like is very appropriate and I'm kind of feeling like a nap now seeing me in bed all comfy. So most mornings are the same. I wake up, I have a good stretch, I throw on my glasses because I am blind without them. I wear contacts every day, guys. I need to see. I always have a large glass of water waiting for me on my bedside table just to chug in the morning, rehydrate my cells, and just energize me. Also, it helps things to get going, if you know what I mean. Pretty soon after I wake up, I go straight into my meditation. Otherwise, just like going to the gym in the morning, I feel like I talk myself out of it. And it is something that, once again, it has truly changed my life. It's something I rely on. I enjoy doing it and it has just made so many changes in my life. I honestly cannot recommend meditation enough. If you live a busy, hectic lifestyle and you feel like you don't have time, trust me making time for this will truly pay off long term our minds are such a complex organ and to me meditation is a form of exercise for my mental health funny enough i almost feel energized and ready for the day once i'm done my meditation so it really does perk me up makes me feel inspired and calm and just a little bit more centered now, at this point, Cashew's already been up for a bit. She's had her breakfast, she's had her morning pee, but she'll usually kind of pop in and lay on her bed while I'm meditating and Matt's in the shower getting himself ready for work. We sort of have like a morning schedule going on that works well for us. And most of the time, Cashew is just a lazy girl in the morning and I kind of love it. I like to think that she also kind of feels the calm energy from when I'm meditating. All right, now it's time to make the bed. Usually the rule is whoever is in the bed last makes it. I'm not gonna lie, first world problems, now that we have a king bed, it is so much harder to make it with one person, but you know, I manage. Otherwise, I'll usually call Matt in to, to help me, but I really like a made bed throughout the day. I'm walking by my room, I look in, it looks all clean and tidy, and it just really sets a good tone for the day. And you get to check off one thing off your list before you even get out of bed or get your coffee. Speaking of coffee, if you've been watching my channel for a while, then you know I actually don't drink coffee or any caffeine. It's something I kind of gave up years ago to help my anxiety and I've just felt so much better ever since. So I'm just boiling some water. P.S. I love this mug. I recently featured it in a Target haul. I'll link it down below. It's so cute. It has a little handle 
and a nice little top that comes off easily to wash it. And it's really good for my walks with cashew. So my drink of choice is herbal coffee, which is basically a mixture of roasted barley and chicory. And it kind of tastes like coffee without the caffeine. It's awesome. I've been drinking it for years. And I also like adding in a little bit of some grass fed collagen. Fill it up with some water and add a splash of unsweetened nut milk. Usually oat or almond are my favorites. I usually just kind of sip on this as I'm getting ready in the morning. Now on this particular morning, I was not going to the gym. I was actually just taking cashew for a walk. So I just grabbed my workout clothes, splashed some water on my face to wake myself up and just refresh my, my skin. I don't actually use cleanser in the morning, just some water and rose water toner. Put in my contacts so I can see things. And then I'm just following up with my skincare. So this is actually just a lightweight oil that I've been using recently. I'm really liking it. And then my hair, I'm just kind of brushing it out. It was a little bit oily on this day. Uh, it was definitely hair washing day, but I'm just giving it a little brush, putting it up and getting it out of my face for my walk with cashew. brushing my teeth. P.S. Love this toothbrush. It's so good. It's by Philips and I will link it down below. It is the best toothbrush I've ever had and it was actually recommended by my dentist. I always laugh because those commercials that always say four out of five dentists recommend this. Mine, mine actually did and I love it. She's the best. Now, before I head out for a walk, I like to kind of set the tone for the house. So when I get back, it smells nice and it's nice and clean. I'm filling up my oil diffuser with some water and essential oils. For the fall season, I'm really liking Thieves and Orange, and I just think they smell really nice together. The Thieves is also an antibacterial and it really helps clean the air, which I love. And I can just set this for one hour, three hours, or six hours to kind of just pump delicious essential oils and help clean the air while I'm just working from home and doing my thing. I'm also setting my little robot Swiffer guy. I will also link this down below. He's amazing. He keeps our floors hair free from cashew because I swear she sheds so much lately. I don't know what it is if she's losing her summer coat, getting ready for the winter. But man, when we wake up, our floors are furry. So this little gadget helps us keep our floors clean. I call him the ninja because he's so quiet and I just love him. He does a very good job. Now it's time for us to head out on our walk. I like to usually walk her with a harness. I just find it so much easier to have control, especially because she's a bigger pup and I don't like just having the leash on her collar. I find it just kind of strains their neck, especially when they're training and learning how to walk. We just upgraded her harness. Uh, this one, Matt accidentally bought a size too big, so we ended up returning it for the next size down. So it was a little loose on her. She's growing, but apparently not that fast. Our walk snack this morning was the Sunday roast uh, little treats. We sell these on the Health Nut Pup. They're so good. The ingredients are super clean. Cashew loves them and they're just, it's always good to have some kind of treats when training your puppy uh, to make sure to reward them when they're doing something good. Popping on my walking shoes. Strapping Miss Cashew in and it's time to walk. I love my morning walks with Cashew. Sometimes we do them in the morning, sometimes in the afternoon. Honestly, having a dog has just made going outside for walks so much more enjoyable. I just love getting out in nature, having a companion with me, and just kind of seeing the world through her, her eyes is so fascinating. And she just gets out, us out more outside in nature and I love it. Okay, so now it's time to eat. I'm starving, it's breakfast time. Now I thought I would switch up my green smoothie as much as I love them for a bowl of oats. So I'm cooking up some just rolled oats here on top of the stove. I will have a recipe for these linked down below. These are basically a variation of my coconut chai spiced oatmeal. It's so good. I just cook it with some full fat coconut milk. I also have some banana in there because I add that to all my oatmeal. For spices, I have some pumpkin spice, ground nutmeg, and of course, cinnamon, because you gotta have cinnamon in your oatmeal. 
To me, this is fall in an oatmeal. It is so warming and flavorful and it just hits all the spots, especially if you haven't picked up a pumpkin spice latte yet or you don't drink coffee like me. This is honestly the next best thing or if not even better. I usually like to add some kind of fruit on top of my oatmeal. So in the spirit of fall and apple season, I'm just chopping up some apple to put on top. Cashew also loves apple, so I usually save a little bit for her too to have as a treat. Once my oatmeal is nice and creamy and cooked, I'm just gonna transfer it into my bowl, top it with my chopped apple. I don't know about you, but I love like the crispy apples, Pink Lady, Fuji, those are my go-tos. A drizzle of some pure maple syrup, more cinnamon, cause you can't have enough and then some pumpkin seeds because fall and it, I just love the crunch that it gives your oatmeal. How delicious does this look? I promise you it was just as tasty and you need to make it. Okay, so now it's time for a really quick hair and makeup fixer upper because I'm just working from home this day, but I also like to put myself together just a little bit so I feel like a normal human being. So I'm just filling in my brows really quickly. I also have been really liking this new eyebrow whiz pen. I will link it down below. It's really good and it makes my brows look so much better than they did when I woke up. I just like to throw on some mascara. I keep my everyday makeup really simple. I also didn't show it, but I put on just like a CC cream that's tinted, has moisturizer and sunscreen in it, and a little bit of powder. Gotta have a good lip balm. I can't stand dry lips, so I always slather my lips with a nice balm. And on this day, I decided to wear this new lipstick that I've been loving, and I actually wore it on my cookbook launch party day. And it just, I feel like putting on a nice lip color really makes it look like you put in way more effort than you did. This is my look for today, and now I'm ready to get to work, start my day, and make some videos for you guys. There you have it, that was my fall morning routine. I would love to know the first three things you do when you wake up in the morning. Leave a comment down below, does it change season to season? I feel like my stuff is usually the same, it just I tweak it depending on the time of the year. Uh, but hopefully you guys found some good little tips or inspiration from this video. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. Click that red subscribe button down below. It's absolutely free. I post here three times a week, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And I can't wait to see you guys in my next video. And I'm gonna have any things that I mentioned in this video linked down below as well for you guys to find them easily. Have a fabulous morning or whenever you're watching this and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.